last episode, we started working on the floor insulation. Now, we are continuing with layers of our insulation and adding the OSB wood panels, as it is readily available and a good material for insulation. It will help with phonic and thermal insulation and it will also level the floor. We started laying down the OSB floor starting with the living area and the kitchen, as it was the biggest area without any walls in between. For sealing properly the floor insulation and creating the sandwich of layers we used polyurethane glue and wood glue. So this is how we decided to make the flooring for our container home. We have four layers. So underneath we have a flooring type of uh, insulation. This is, is this roll here. So it has on one side this green thing which is a foam, uh, extruded foam. And then on the other side is a aluminum foil mylar called mylar, right? So we put it on the other side so it will uh, it will radiate the the the, the cold back to the to the underside of the container. We made sure that uh, the seams are very uh, tight, so basically airtight. This is aluminium tape. After this, we go with five centimeter extruded foam. This is the foam, which is I think it's very standard for everything everything around constructions, at least in Europe. Uh, you can buy it anywhere and this is a very highly dense extruded foam so it's used to uh, to do flooring on multiple level buildings after this we come with osb panels these are here one on top and we will um, and we are, we are basically gluing them we are gluing them with uh, polyurethane spray foam so basically this is a special uh, polyurethane foam which is used for this type of, uh, it's basically a good glue. And we are doing this and then on the fourth layer we will have another, another insulation like this. Only this side will be with the aluminium top up which will reflect the radiation, the heat radiation or the cold in the house itself. And, and after that we will put some uh, hardwood flooring.
We have now a proper floor and we can continue building the rooms and adding the wall panels. The OSB floor will stay in place until the final part of the interior decoration where we'll add a layer of hardwood oak flooring. We decided to go for oak as it is a very good hardwood and the floor can be kept in shape with small service every few years. This is the last episode related to the installation project of our container house. From now on we will have smaller projects and all of them will be mostly about systems like electricity, plumbing and the outside work such as the roof, painting the container and building a terrace in front of the container. We are working on the longer video where we will outline the decision making process, tools we used the cost of the container and lessons learned from our build so far. We hope you like it and get inspired in your builds. <laughs>